Peggy 18. Lara Croft is one of the most iconic heroines in video game history. In this reimagining, we go back to the very beginning to tell an origin story that takes the player on an incredible journey to discover how she becomes a Tomb Raider. This video series will dive into the world of Tomb Raider, exploring the harrowing challenges and decisions Lara faces as she's forced to survive. Lara's first adventure begins after she and her crew embark on what was supposed to be an adventure of a lifetime, only to find themselves shipwrecked and left for dead on a mysterious island in the Dragon's Triangle. Lara Croft doesn't begin as a fully accomplished and capable heroine. She's smart, resourceful, and full of potential. In this episode, we'll explore how Lara uses her wits to succeed and her smarts to become a survivor. A key element of this new Tomb Raider is the base camp system. Base camps are the backbone of the game, acting as the customization hub, allowing us to develop and support the three core experiences within the game smart resourceful Laura, exploration, and survival combat. Laura needs to learn new skills and upgrade her weapons in order to uncover the island mystery and defeat its dangerous inhabitants. She can earn experience through actions such as exploring, completing missions, and succeeding in combat. Once Lara has collected enough experience, she's awarded a skill point, which can be used to unlock new skills in the base camp. These skills grant Lara a wide variety of exploration and combat abilities. An early example of the upgrade system can be seen in the climbing axe. This piece of gear starts out as a makeshift item, which Lara acquires early on, helping her pry open doors and break open salvage crates. However, it soon outlives its requirement. Shit! It won't take the force. I'll have to find something sturdier to turn it with. And Laura must find more salvage to make the climbing axe stronger in order to move forward. The climbing axe comes into play when Laura interacts with zip lines and also as a way to protect herself. Salvage can be found all over the island. Shit! Though some is more difficult to secure than others. Once enough salvage is collected, Lara can use the base camp to upgrade her gear with new functionality. Another representation of Lara's wits is survival instinct. This can be activated at any time and is incredibly useful in identifying key puzzle elements and hidden rewards. Fire, water, and wind behave realistically in Tomb Raider and can all be used to solve puzzles or progress through certain areas. Fire can also help Lara acquire hard-to-get salvage stashed in crates that are hanging in nets. Meanwhile, wind can add an innovative layer of complexity to environmental puzzles. Early in her adventure, Lara finds a bow. This becomes her signature weapon, as versatile as it is deadly. At first, Lara uses it to hunt in order to survive on the island. Soon, it becomes a means of protection from vicious animals. Eventually, Lara must use it in combat against the deadly island scavengers. Lara learns to use the bow to great effect as a weapon of stealth, from afar or up close and personal. In the next video, we'll explore how Lara uses her skills and tools to traverse through dangerous environments. Lara moves from being a victim of the island to conquering it. Next time on Guide to Survival.